Hey guys, this is Gonsham. Welcome to World Trending News. Joe Biden Vladimir Putin agreed to meet over Ukraine crisis, on a condition. Russia-Ukraine crisis, the summit, proposed by France's Emmanuel Macron, will be expanded to relevant stakeholders to discuss security and strategic stability in Europe. Kiev, Russian President Vladimir Putin and his U.S. counterpart Joe Biden have agreed to a summit to be held only if Moscow does not invade Ukraine, France announced Monday following a frantic new round of diplomacy to avert an all-out war. Both leaders have said yes in principle to the summit, proposed by French President Emmanuel Macron, his office said, with the White House confirming Biden's willingness, though it was notably cautious. A senior administration official told AFP, timing to be determined. Format to be determined so it's all completely notional. The Elysee added that the summit will be expanded to relevant stakeholders and that preparations would start between Russia and the United States on Thursday. The possible breakthrough came after Washington warned of an imminent invasion and Ukraine and Russia blamed each other for a spike in shellings on the front line separating Kiev's forces from Moscow-backed separatists. The bombardments have sent Ukrainians fleeing to cellars and other shelters, while some civilians have been evacuated. In its own statement, the White House warned that it was still ready to impose swift and severe consequences should Russia invade. And currently, Russia appears to be continuing preparations for a full-scale assault on Ukraine very soon, U.S. Press Secretary Jen Psaki said. Washington and other Western capitals say that Russia has massed more than 150,000 troops on Ukraine's borders and is ready to launch a full-scale assault. Moscow denies any intention to invade its neighbor, but has demanded that the NATO alliance permanently rule out Ukraine's bid for membership and called for the withdrawal of Western forces deployed in Eastern Europe since the end of the Cold War. Macron Putin Calls The announcement of the summit came moments after Macron held his second marathon call with Putin of the day. During their first, 105-minute discussion, Putin blamed the increase in violence on the front line on provocations carried out by the Ukrainian security forces, according to a Kremlin statement. Putin repeated a call for the United States and NATO to take Russian demands for security guarantees seriously. But Macron's office also said the two had agreed on the need to favor a diplomatic solution to the ongoing crisis and to do everything to achieve one. This is Gansham, welcome to the World Trending News. If you want to more update regarding around the World Trending News, then subscribe our channel and press the bell icon and share with your friend and family. Thank you very much for watching our video. Thank you.